I bought the cheapest aluminum shocks I could find on eBay. Are they going to be any good? Let's check them out. Excellent! What's going on dudes and dudettes? Thanks again for tuning in to 4 Boys RC. My name is Phil. Thanks for tuning in. Today we're going to talk about these wonderful shocks. There we is, hobby marking. If you remember my last video, we had some hobby marking products. Again, we're back with the hobby marking. These came in at a very, very inexpensive price point. I will put a link in the description box below so you guys can find these easily. I paid about, I want to say it was about $23 or $24 Canadian for these shipped from China. So uh, as far as price point goes, guys, I don't think it's going to be beat. $24, bucks. these things are, they look really nice. So let's get into this package and see what it's all about. So there's a bit of a closer look, guys, in the packaging. And you can see they look like they're really nice quality. Very similar to like uh, Yeah Racing or Free Racing product is what it looks like to me. So we crack her open, guys, and this is what you're going to get. Again, we've got our nice little decal sheet here, option number one. We have some hardware. It's stainless. It's hex. Appears to be two mil. Now, let's talk about the shocks, because this is what we're all here to scope out. So, overall build quality looks pretty nice from the outside. Anodizing looks good. Shock feels nice and smooth. I don't know if there's oil in there. It doesn't feel like it. Maybe just a tiny little bit. And one thing that I really like, guys, is that the upper and lower mounts came with the little metal eyelets in here already. I've bought cheap shocks online before and they were missing these. So that's something to really look forward to because if you don't have them, it's kind of a pain in the butt. Muy importante, and we have them here, which is all sorts of rad. Now let's go a step further, start taking the shocks apart and see what they look like on the inside. All right, so there is a little bit of oil in there. You can see some nice shiny residue on there, so that's good. So we know the O-rings inside here aren't going to be damaged. Now, that being said, the shock isn't full of oil. I think they just put enough in there just for assembly purposes. Oh, we're leaking. We're leaking. Uh, so it looks like a two-hole piston in there. Assembly looks like it was done well. It does have the bladder in here to help keep from leaking oil. We've got a completely threaded shock body, which is pretty cool. So you can adjust your preload with this collar right here. Let's see how nice it works. Let's see if it's... Machining is nice and uh, threads are nice and it uh, works like a hot damn. And again, this is a really, you know, budget friendly solution. So it didn't come with any extra springs. What you saw in the package is what we get. So no, no extra pistons, no extra springs. It's just what you see is what you get. You're going to be tuning these with your shock oil. And that's going to be pretty much the max tunability that you're going to get out of them. But for 25 bucks, can't really go wrong. So if you're looking for an inexpensive solution for your oil-filled aluminum dampers on your RC rally car or road car, these I think are going to be a great option for you. Be sure to check them out. And if you guys have any questions about them, please feel free to throw them down in the comment section below. Always happy to answer all you guys. Have an awesome weekend and be excellent to each other.